All righty, coming in this next match, we've got Drew Ayala rep representing the Seabolt Wrestling Academy and Antonio Mills representing Minion Legends. Antonio in on a shot real quick. Ayala doing a good job of getting those hips back and getting to a front head. Mills holding on to that elbow, trying to get to his feet, looking to cover. Ayala trying to keep that front head, and it looks like he's going to go. Could try to go for a shuck by there in the front head. Not successful with it, and they're back up to their feet. Another shot attempt from Mills as he tries to bring it up. Ayala trying to dig for an underhook and get his hips back right there. Mills trying to drive him out of bounds and get a point. Nothing there, and they're back over into the neutral again. Sweep attempt there from Ayala, but he's not successful. And they're going to call... They're going to call Ayala for a passive warning. One more passivity warning. He's going to be put on the shot clock. 30 seconds on the shot clock. If he doesn't score, he's going to get a point for Mills. So we're back in a neutral here. Another shot attempt from Mills. Driving it up to a double. So if he'll finish it. And he's going to get one point for a step out. No, he's going to get a confirmed two points for a takedown. Listen, like, like, yeah, Huh? All righty, and we're back in a neutral. Mills getting that quick two off on the takedown. And we're back in a neutral. Both opponents doing a good job of stalking. Mills in on another shot, trying to bring it up to his feet to finish. Ayala going wizard defense right there, trying to get that step out right there. See if we're gonna possibly get a step out right here with the head. And we're not, we're gonna remain grounded. It's gonna be no points for anybody. We're gonna come back to the center. Got a minute and 23 seconds left in here in the first period. Once again, both doing a good job, keeping their levels low, avoiding any open shots that could be coming. Mills trying to get in on another attempt. Again, Ayala with a quick slip. Uh, go behind, up on his feet, and Ayala is going to get the four points for feet to back. It is now going to be four two in favor of Ayala with one minute coming back, one minute remaining in the first period of this match. Another shot from Mills trying to bring it up. Ayala goes back to that wizard. He's trying to, coming back, Mills now has an underhook. I'll uh, hard overhook down on that. Mills tries to go slide by here. He's not able to get it, and we're back on our feet right here. I'll maintaining an elbow control on that right arm. Mills trying to go for a shot there again, but it's too far away. And we're back in the neutral. 15 seconds coming into the coming to the coming towards the end of this first period as we have a 4-2 score it looks like for Drew Ayala unless any last minute scoring opportunities open themselves up here and that's not going to happen that's going to be the end of this first period 4-2 lead for Drew Ayala as we go into the break Alrighty, and we're back in here with the second period of this match. Once again, Ayala leading 4-2. Been a good match so far. Plenty of attacking attempts from both sides. Ayala getting that four-point throw to help put him in the lead. Now, as I say that, he's going to get a front head on Mills. Mills doing a good job of controlling that elbow. Ayala trying to look for a push out right here. 
But Mills doing a good job of getting horizontal right here so he doesn't have as much leverage, but that doesn't look like it's gonna stop Ayala from trying to drive in and get that push out. No, no push out awarded just yet. No one's hit the mat and it's gonna be grounded. No points awarded to anybody. We're gonna go back to the center and get reset here. A little motion going on out in the open with some fakes. And Blue is Blue is gonna be called for a passivity warning. Once again, one more, he's gonna be put on the shot clock. So both wrestlers with a passivity call here on three. Ayala again with that sweep, nice inside tie sweep there. Mills coming back with that reattack of the sweep. Ayala trying to go go behind there. Doesn't look like he's gonna get it though. We're back up to our feet again. Mills in on that shot again, but Ayala getting his legs back in time in order to evade that and not let him get any deeper. I say that, he goes back in again and gets it. And he's gonna drive him out and get a push out. So now it's gonna be 4-3 for Ayala still with a minute 34 left in this match. Ayala going with the, trying to go with the double inside ties. Mills is doing a good job controlling that left arm. Trying to go collar tie there. Ayala keeps going for that sweep. Mills likewise with that same shot, that same single on the right side. One minute as we come to the end of this match. Let's see what's gonna happen here. Any surprise scores. Goes for the leg again and he gets it. And he's gonna get the push out there. It's gonna be four all. Ayala has criteria right now over Mills since he has a four point throw. So even though the score is the same, Mills is gonna have to go after and get one more point in order to win this match. Shot attempt here from Ayala. Mills able to get his leg back and defend it back up to their feet. Little go behind attempt, underhook inside, underhook for Ayala. See what he does with it. Nothing happened there. Mills back in on a shot. Gonna try and go behind to finish it. Ayala doing a good job. Tries to go hip tilt right there. Isn't gonna get it. Mills still going behind, trying to get this takedown. And that's gonna be two red. That's gonna be, and that's gonna be it. And we're gonna figure out the score right here. Judge is gonna come up and discuss this. Gonna see what the final verdict is gonna be. So we will get back to you shortly. Yeah, two red, two blue. Yeah. We got six, six, red wins by criteria. And that's going to do it for you for this match. Drew Ayala getting the win. With